Press the bell icon on YouTube and don't miss another update. James Christian Michel, the British national living in the UAE, who has been extradited by the UAE government to India earlier this week, who has been plastered all over the TV channels and the newspapers and is being considered a win by the Modi government in its fight against corruption. None other than Prime Minister Narendra Modi at a rally in Rajasthan a few days ago said that Michel would now begin to sing like a canary, allegedly because the Sonia Gandhi family had taken kickbacks from the VVIP Augusta Westland helicopter deal in which James Christian Michel was allegedly a middleman. Now that's one fact in my column today, Global Print. The other fact is that Sheikha Latifa, the daughter of the ruler of Dubai, Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, had escaped from Dubai. It was a very daring escape. She took the help of a former French spy, a former French naval officer, and another Finnish friend, uh, all three of them drove to Oman, got into a jet ski, took the jet ski into international waters, got into a dinghy and then, um, uh, and then floated or, or, or came all the way into, from the international waters into India's coastal waters. And in March, the Indian Coastal Guard picked them up and guess what, forcibly sent her back to Dubai. Now, the, in my information is that there was a direct quid pro quo between forcibly sending back Sheikha Latifa to her father, to the ruler of Dubai, and the extradition of James Christian Michel. These are sources in the government who have told me that, that there is a very, very obvious linkage, a direct linkage between the two. People are not willing to come on record so far, but this is the information that we have at the print. Please read my column Global Print and keep watching the YouTube channel of the print. It's alive and buzzing.